Hey guys, the chicken is here. We are back today with another Boom Beach video. In today's video, guys, we're falling off the mountain. Everything has gone downhill since we got to Diamond the other day. Sometimes that just seems to be how it goes in warships, but um, it is very frustrating to make a certain rank and then not be able to uh, maintain your chest there. But we're going to go over what's been working, what people are using, all that good stuff. If you haven't already, guys, I appreciate it if you use that code chicken in the shop. I think they need to get rid of that ad thing. Um, not get rid of it. Um, but they need to redo it because it's very annoying to click and then go into the shop, take your rewards, and then go out and then have to click again. It's not the end of the world, I guess. I mean, there's worse things that could happen to you, but it is kind of annoying. Um, so yeah, we're going to hop over onto the warship. And look at this. We fell all the way back. All the way back to rank 19, guys. Only two wins today. Just straight sucking. Just a full-on day of sucking. Um, nothing worked. Couldn't get anything going. Tried a bunch of different strategies, a bunch of different stats. Um, but yeah, I don't know. It was very strange, very strange. I also did a lot of swapping around stuff, which was also annoying because, um, I probably spent 5,000 diamonds today just in swapping stuff only to go backwards, which is really not fun. Um, I don't really see shock bombs helping us out at this point. I think I'm at, you know, where I'm at now, I'm probably going to grab the next prototype and then go to six. Um, even though... You know, we probably do want those bombers sooner than later. So, I don't know. I might skip shocks, too, and just go to 6 ER. Um, actually, no, we already unlocked Gren, so I guess I am. Uh, I'm going to be stuck on that boat. Hmm. Probably shouldn't have unlocked Gren. But, I mean, we're going to have to do it at some point anyway, so. Sorry, I'm scrolling back and forth, freaking out. Um, so, yeah, we've collected another gold chest since making Diamond. And here's the stats that I went with today. Now, I feel like these are the optimal stats to be running right now. 50 BH, 80 DBD, 50 troop health, 50 troop damage, and 50 gunboat energy. I wonder if we can swap that GB for anything, or is it just a straight... No, it's just a straight gunboat node. So, yeah, there's nothing else more that we can even upgrade at this point. So, yeah, we are just kind of... Uh, we're stuck at the moment. So, that's what we're doing in terms of stats. Here's the base. Now, this base I copied from somebody that was much higher than me. They were in rank 23, I believe it was, um, I believe it was DK. Um, I don't see him on the leaderboard now, though. Oh, yeah, there he is. So, this was the idea, because I had very similar tech to this guy. Oh, he's completely changed. He's now 6 ER, 2, 4, 6. So, maybe that's why. Maybe that happened a couple days ago, and he was, uh, just collecting to go to 6. Hmm. This seems to be what everybody's running at six engines, so we'll see. We'll see. So for now, we're uh, we're still using heavy chopper rush, and I found a couple of things that made it work a little bit better. Um, the good thing about heavy chopper rush is that you know you're gonna get engines, and it is fairly fast too when you do clear the whole base. So yeah, um, I'll show you what we've been doing. So flare's been flare smoke, and then. That's pretty well it. Having enough GB to launch all the heavy choppers has been helpful. Um, I've tried with ex experimenting, going back to heavy choppers and zookas, or even throwing a couple zookas in, um, you know, to free clear out of the gates and then use the GB, but it just seems to be heavy choppers works a little bit better. Um, yeah, so let's see. Let's try to... Uh, let's try to... All right, this guy's got... All right, so we're going to go, yeah, this one's going to be tough. This one's tough to chopper rush because you can't go from the back, you can't really go from the side, and you kind of just have to eat it going from this way. So let's go like that, and I think we're just going to go engine to engine to engine here and try to smoke them, try to smoke them around maybe, but I won't even do that actually because um, all that's going to do is focus all the... Uh, everything on my heavy choppers, which is what we kind of want to avoid. So we're going to go up here next. And let's go barrage here on these shock mines. Did I miss the shock mine? No, okay. Good. Good, good, good. Alright, so we're going to take this engine down next. Now we can actually use our smokes. And I'm just going to use one here. That's all that we need. Fine if I use two, what happens is those heavy choppers get stuck and then the other ones are exposed and they die and, you know, bad things kind of happen from there. 
So it's important when you're heavy chopper rushing through critter launcher critters, don't ever stop, don't ever free clear. All that's going to happen is you're just going to, um, you know, you're slowly going to die. So I'm going to opt for some barrage on. Now what I could have done there is save that barrage and hit all those critters. Probably would have been better. But if we can get this engine down, then that's pretty successful. I don't think we're going to be able to get that last one down coming all the way across the top because we've lost all of our heavies. Uh, at this point, the critters, as you can see, they're just kind of sitting there. So they've eaten all the heavies. They are full. Um, let's go like this. And I will smoke these guys across just because that's going to allow the heavies to stay alive. Um, we're, I don't think we're going to get this engine, but we can at least get some chip on it. There's so many critters there. And you see when they start to add up like that, look at look how quickly they eat these heavies. It's just one, two, three, four. Like they just absolutely chow through them. Pretty crazy stuff. Pretty crazy stuff. Now, since we don't have all the DVD that we had um, before, hey, there we go. Well, we're in 19, so I mean, I, I feel like that should be expected. Oh, it's Orion. Oh, my God. GG's. Orion's a really good player. He got a top 50 trophy, which the chicken does not have. Um, so, yeah. That was strange. Typically, that's, uh, that's really what I've been doing all day. I and mean, that was like my third win, so I don't know what's going on. But, um, yeah. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I mean, I don't know. Maybe everything will work out, and then we'll catapult ourselves back to 20, 2070, not 2021, not tw not diamond, not be able to collect, and then, you know, fall back down to 2020. That's what it, I feel like the last few days have been like, but, um, yeah, let's see. Okay, okay, okay. Um, interesting. So, the engines are kind of close together over here. I think we'll flare them like that. I don't really see a need to barrage anything. Nothing that's super urgent anyways. I wonder if it would make sense when we do that to smoke them when they land. So then rather than taking a bunch of heavy chopper damage right at the beginning, we would just simply... Um, like, you know what I mean? The heavies will pop at the same time, and then that, that would take some pressure off the heavy choppers. Maybe that would make sense. I don't know. Okay, okay. We are probably going to get shock locked here in a second. Let's see. Smoky, smoky. Trying to use the little bit of GB that we have at some points. Um, okay. Now see how I kind of doubled up that smoke? That's so I don't cover any of the heavy choppers the last one. We might take this engine down. This is going to be close. Eh. If we do, it's going to be... going to be greasy. Um... Those heavy choppers dying might help us, actually. Look at this, look at this. We might get this one. I think we got it. I think we got it. Let's go. I don't know what happened there. Okay. Those retreated right at... What is going on? This was not happening today at all. Now, we're still low 20, so maybe that's why. But He went heavy chopper rush, and he didn't... What did he do? He didn't even get off the ground. He went, he has Kavan. Why would you drop them that way and then flare them this way? To get the heavies out? What is he doing? He's just wasting time? I am so confused. Ban him. Somebody ban this guy. <laughs> what is that? Oh my god. All right, let's try another one. I mean, it seems to be working. Well, it's working so much as our opponents are just kind of flaring back and forth on the landing ramp, but you never know in this game sometimes. <clears throat> Actually, you do know. You do know. You know you're going to have a lot of highs and a lot of lows right after those highs. That's typically how it works. All right, let's see. Let's see, let's see. What do we got? What do we got? Um... Okay, I think I'll just keep doing what's been working. I mean, why change it? Why change it now, right? 
Okay, okay. Doom Cannon's gonna make this a little bit trickier. It might lose a couple heavy choppers. They're also dumping the heavies behind them, which is kind of annoying. Okay. Alright, come on HCs. So I think the key there is not smoking the heavies around the corner because all that does is forces the Doom Cannon onto, um, I missed my first smoke. It forces the Doom Cannon onto the heavy choppers and then they all die right away, so. Um, I don't know what's gonna happen here. This guy didn't have critter launchers, so I mean, I could have gone kind of more around the world and taken out the shock launchers and stuff. But, oh, he didn't do that. So let's keep it rolling. Okay, okay. You guys go over there. And I'm going to save my GB here for flares for when the heavy choppers die, because that's going to be more important, I feel like. And I'm putting a med kit. But you see what I mean? Like, you want to avoid doing that with your smokes. I do that all the time. I'll wait till pretty well all of them go down, I think. And the heavies that do fall now, if they can take out the flamethrowers, that's not the end of the world. Uh, we might just be able to go... Let's go barrage at this point. That pulls retreat again. I don't know what's going on, guys. I don't know what's going on. We might have to change this video. I was this was gonna be an everything's going terrible today video. Maybe it's not so terrible. Maybe we can squeak back in the diamond. We're facing a lot of 19s as well though, so that might be part of it. And we also got our first win of the day stars, so. Well let's see. I'll keep this going because we're winning. That's always fun. Winning is always fun in warships. Um, any new news? What else has been going on? Uh, if you guys didn't see, I posted on the community tab a couple, a few days ago, maybe early or late last week. Um, Squad Busters, the newest Supercell game is going into uh, soft launch. So it's not like global or anything, but, um, it's going to be available to play in like the usual countries like Canada, um, Finland, that kind of stuff. So if you guys are interested, uh, you can just check out my channel. It's called Clash with Chicken, and I post all that stuff over there. Um, all right, let's see here. This base is a little bit different. A little bit different. Okay, okay. We will smoke some of these guys. Smokey, smokey. Oh, I just got a notification. Fallout New Vegas, your game is ready to play. Yeah, Fallout was like $3 on Steam. I, I don't know if they timed that with the show that I was talking about yesterday, but... Um, but yeah, I got the itch, so I just re-downloaded that one. And we're going to hit a bunch of shock lines here. This base looks much harder for Heavy Chopper Rush. Let's see what happens here. We've got a lot of heavies kind of spread out everywhere. Um... Let's see. I feel like we're not even gonna get one more engine down. Come on, come on, come on. Nope, that is gonna be that. Ouch. Better to flare the engine in that situation because if not, they're just gonna start shooting all the critter launcher critters, so. I'm pretty sure we're going to lose this one. I don't know. I didn't look at that guy's stats, really. Um, oh, actually, this doesn't look bad, guys. This doesn't look bad. Most of his heavies are dead. Oh, no, he free cleared me. No, he got the free clear. He used Zookas and just got, like, three engines. That's weird that I fizzled so hard on him because he didn't really have any defensive boost. Um, and I think he just got the win right now because I only got two engines, so... That sucks. But um, either way, there it is. So that's what's been working and not working today. I don't know. That was weird. But I um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I think what we want to do next, I would I would recommend going to 6 faster than 
doing what I'm going to do, get shock bombs and stuff. I don't think those are going to help out too much. Plus, we want bombers, right? We want bombers as soon as we can. We want bullet. We want laser rangers. Um, probably want laser rangers, I think. I don't know. That's a little bit down the road, but uh, troop health over here is going to be good too. Um, shock launchers. Lots of good stuff at 6 just initially, so I think that's where we, we should head next. Um, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, thanks so much for watching. That is going to wrap it up for the video today. Make sure you leave a like if it's interesting, entertaining, or informative. Catch the next one, guys. Chicken out. Back, back.